best thing about having short hair. It goes everywhere. Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Paula Niebla, for those of you that don't know me yet. And first off, I'm just gonna say I cut my hair, and I mean that might be obvious for you guys that watch my videos, but I chopped off my hair and I couldn't be happier. I love it, I feel so free. And honestly, I, I have been thinking about cutting off my hair for a long time already because I just really wanted to change, but I didn't know when to do it. And thanks to my friend Sabrina because she cut it and did an amazing job. So starting this monthly favorite, my favorite thing is my hair for this month. And this is my first one. I'm so excited about it. I have lots of great stuff that I want to show you guys and that I'm really excited to keep using. So yeah, stick around and let's get into the video. Okay, so I'm going to start with the beauty stuff. Let me just talk about this. This perfume bottle. Well, not the perfume bottle, the perfume. Duh. But, oh my god. Okay, little short story. <laughs> I ran out of perfume and I really needed a new perfume and my mom's like just use this perfume it's mine um, she's like I my mom uses more like her Chanel perfumes but she had this full bottle so she was like just use this one and I was like no it smells so sweet it, I'm really picky about scents and I was like no it smells too sweet I'm not gonna be able to wear it blah 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 and then she's like here just like on the meantime right so then I started using it and I was like I'm like, oh, it's so sweet. And I was like, oh, it's so sweet. And I was like, oh, I like this. And I was like, oh my God. And then now I'm like showering in this, this thing. Oh, I don't even know how to describe it. It's just like, it smells so good. It's called, it's by Salvatore Ferragamo. And this one's called Encanto. But apparently I just Googled it right now because I wanted to read to you guys the scent, like the, what do they call it? The main ingredients or... I forgot the word they use for like perfumes, but apparently he has all his perfumes are called Encanto for ladies, but they have like side names. So this one's Encanto Charms. Uh, and it's just, let me read you guys what it has. Now I'll remember the word. Oh, the notes. That's what I forget that they call it like notes. So it has honeysuckle, passion fruit, jasmine, autumn and rose, amorous wood, and musk. Musk. I love when they that has like that like musky scent but it's like it's sweet but it's like kind of like not masculine but like I don't know how to describe it it's like the perfect summer scent and it's uh, it's like it's just you guys just just smell it at least just smell it and so you can know what I'm talking about it smells so good I'm obsessed and it's a huge bottle too so I'm not gonna be running out anytime soon so Sorry, mom. I actually love it now. <laughs> okay, my next beauty favorite is okay. This I haven't used one of these since I was like in sixth grade. Like these were my go-to's in sixth grade. It's like the closest I could get to wearing lipstick, but I really like it. So this is the Burt's Bees Lip Shimmer, and it's in the shade Peony. I'll probably do a swatch and show you guys the color. It's really cute, especially because when you don't want to wear lipstick, but you don't want to wear, um, what do you call it, lip gloss either, but you do want to moisturize your lips and have like a slight tint, and it's cute because it shimmers, so it's really nice. Yeah, I just really like it. It's a great color. I'm so glad I rediscovered this, and I've been using it nonstop this month, so these babies. So okay. it's this Eco Tools like body scrubber. It has a little thing to place your hand and it has like the bristles. It's rough, but not to the point where you like, you can't use it. It's like the perfect amount because you really do exfoliate. So what I do is I exfoliate my entire body with body wash just all over. I don't do it every single day. I do it like maybe every other day or like three times a week maybe. I don't know, but I just scrub all over and then after using this, I put this baby on. This is by the brand Organics. It's called the Hydrating Argan Oil of Morocco. And it says dry body oil, but it says in the back like you can put it on in the shower, which is what I do. So I put this all over in the shower 
and then just put it all over my body, my legs, my arms, everywhere, my booty. And then I let it sit and then I do my conditioner or whatever the heck other thing I'm doing, washing my face. And then after a while, I rinse it off. And obviously I use this after exfoliating my body because it's amazing. And then I rinse it off right before I'm gonna get out of the shower. And then ugh, once you towel dry yourself, like your skin just smells so good and it's so soft. And then I actually have the argan oil of Morocco been in lotion. So it's the same scent. So after I get out and when I use this, I put that lotion on and the scent is even stronger. And my skin is just feeling so nice and creamy and I'm obsessed. I like to do that when it's like a night that I'm gonna go out or I'm just like, I just wanna pamper myself. I use these two products, definitely recommend. And you guys should really start exfoliating your skin because we do have a lot of like dead skin cells that are just like gross. So you just need to get rid of that. Maybe not every day, but like I said, maybe every other day or like three times a week. Definitely recommend it. I love it. Mm, and I think that's it for beauty favorites. The rest is just like random stuff that I just really liked for this month. And I'm going to start with accessories. I've been really into like thrifting glasses and just like not really wearing like my high-end glasses all the time and just like wearing funky glasses. And I'm obsessed with these. I don't know if they can really come off because all you can see is like the camera and the reflection, but I think they are so cute. They look like this. If you follow me on Instagram, I posted a picture of when I first cut my hair with these glasses on and I think they are so cute. I thrifted them in San Diego at the uh, Buffalo Exchange in Pacific Beach. That's my favorite thrift store. They always have the, you find the greatest things and they always have like really cute glasses. So. I'm really obsessed with these and I love how it's like the blue reflector ones, kind of like the Amanda Steele ones that she came out with Koi Australia. It's kind of like that, but it's like darker blue and they're cat eyed. So I really like these. I'm obsessed. And mom's like, you like those? I'm like, yeah, mom, I love those. She always thinks I wear like weird things, but I don't. My next favorites are these chokers. I'm obsessed with these. Okay, I'm going to start with these two because my sister gave me these two and they're so pretty they're like little like rocks kind of like amethysts like stones and this one's um brown goldish and it has like the silver detail and it's a black um suede choker thing and then this one's blue and it has like a taupey suede necklace strap what am i what am i saying the strap is a suede oh my god I can't talk right now, but, but they are so cute. I'm obsessed with them. I've had, a, I've gotten a lot of compliments on them and I really want to thank my sister for getting me one because I thought she was only going to get me one and then she got me two and they're so pretty and I'm obsessed and I've never had like a brown choker. Like I feel like nowadays like every choker is like black. So I really like this one. So obsessed. Another favorite that I have are these clips and these are actually from Forever 21. They're super inexpensive. They were like around, oh it says right here, $1.90. And these are the clips that we all had when we were little girls that we would just like play with them and like twist them. I've been really liking these because ever since I cut my hair, I've been doing like little different styles where I like pull my hair back and just put like three different clips just for like details. I'm not gonna really explain much because I'm actually planning on doing a how I style my short hair and I'm probably gonna be using these but I've just been really into them and they're really fun to play with so gotta have these in my favorites. Another one of, okay that's it for like jewel, oh no wait I'm missing this ring. This ring, oh my god I'm obsessed. This is another accessory that I got in my Chappas trip and my mommy splurged on this for me and I love her so much. It's literally my favorite ring in the world. I'll do a little close-up, but pretty much it's just like three little like burgundy stones and it's a um, silver um, detailed band and I just think it's the cutest thing. I love it so much. It's so pretty and detailed and uh, I just, I'm obsessed with rings. That's why and she's like, okay, I'll get it for you. I'm like, thanks mommy. I really like it. have to have this in my favorites. I try not to wear it every single day because I want it to stay in good condition, but it's so cute. How can I not? <laughs> this makes me so happy. Okay, so my best friend's little sister is actually a really good friend of mine as well. 
she got me this mug because they went on a road trip to Yosemite and I am obsessed this has become my go-to mug for drinking coffee if you guys can see it clearly it's a Volkswagen van mug it's so cute it has like little wheels and then it says on the license plate it says Yosemite and it's my favorite color red so I just think it's so cute I was so happy when she gave it to me I was like oh my god this is the coolest thing in the world Annette if you're watching this thank you so much I'm obsessed still I, I think I'm probably gonna make some coffee after this video and drink out of this mug because that's how happy it makes me so thank you so much I love you had to add this in this video okay I've been waiting to talk to you guys about this I'm really late on reading this I actually got this book for Christmas by my best friend she gave it to me and oh my god I love it and it's the book by Tyler Oakley binge oh my god if you haven't read this book please pick up a coffee please pick up a coffee please pick up a copy of this book because it's hilarious if you love tyler oakley as much as i do you have to get it honestly i didn't expect it to be this good just because i thought it was going to be more like i don't know i didn't think he would say like everything like in this book like he literally has no filter in this book and i love it like Oh, uh, there was this one part I wanted to like read to you guys because I literally cracked up for a full minute on that. It was so funny. I mean, I don't really like he has a chapter where it's just like it's 20 things I do if I were Beyonce for a day. It's so funny. Like he has so many good stories. He has life lessons, funny stories, list of random things like self promos and self promo in his book like um, and then like I don't know like it's so funny it's so quirky I think it's really different from any other like bio book that I've read before because I've read a couple and I don't know it's just not like it's so genuine and real and he doesn't try to like cover anything up and he's just like this is what happened and this is how I up like it's so funny I I just want to meet him so bad and be like your book is amazing please write a second one like now right now like go write a second one because I need to know your the rest of your story so I really liked it thank you Emily for giving me this book I'm obsessed I, you need to read it okay you're gonna borrow it after I'm done with it and you're gonna read it because we need to talk about it finally my last favorite is this beautiful beautiful dream catcher that once again I know I'm repetitive I got it on my trip to Mexico but okay so I really wanted to get a dream catcher. They had tons there, like actually like authentic dream catchers, like with sticks and like actual real bird feathers and stuff. But when I saw this one, I just knew I had to have it. I have right now it's displayed like I display it on top of like my bed. I have like a little like thumbtack and I just put it on there. But every time I walk into my room, this makes me so happy because it's a color. It's just like, okay, I'm going to show you guys. I'm going to reveal it. It looks like this, and then it has all these different colored feathers. <laughs> Anyways, but it has different colored feathers, and I just think it's so cute. And then it has like a yellow pebble right here, and I don't know, I'm just like so obsessed with this. I think it's so cute. It makes me so happy. I don't know. And then it has like beading too, of course, like just just like wow man just like ah just look at it it's just beautiful it makes me so happy I just want to burst into tears when I see it not really but you know what I mean like it's so cute I love it like you can't find this at Urban Outfitters and honestly guys this cost me eight dollars in pesos but like in dollars it was eight dollars best eight dollars I've ever spent in my life this at Urban Outfitters would have cost you like 50 bucks probably mm -hmm. so that was the last item of my favorites video I had so much fun filming this video and now I know why youtubers love filming these I think I'm gonna start filming these every month now because I really liked it 
and yeah that's it for this video make sure to subscribe to my channel if you're not subscribed already because i am working on tons of new videos that i want to show you guys and share with you i'm really excited to try and get creative with this channel and just really like really brainstorm for it uh, before i go i want to say thank you to everyone that subscribed to my channel i finally reached 100 subscribers and it makes me so happy because that's like a million subscribers to me like having when i had 30 subscribers i thought i was like the best like thing in the world i was like oh my god people are actually watching my videos but yeah thank you so much to everyone that has subscribed to my channel i love you guys hopefully my channel keeps growing in a good direction and i just want to be able to share my stuff with you guys and hopefully you guys like it so yeah that's it for this video and i'll talk to you guys in my next one so Bye, guys. Mwah.